Hey, I'm going to show you how you as an attendee of an event in Berkeley can become a speaker and also share your uh, thoughts and views on the main stage. So how does that work? You can see as normally you enter the event in the lobby and as soon as the host, so the organizer of the event realizes that you're in and they want to bring you to the backstage, what they can do is they can click here to attendees they can click on your profile, in this case, click on my profile, and they can select you as a speaker. So that's all they do. So you don't have to worry about anything and your host will take care of that. So they set you as a speaker, but you will now realize what is happening here on the left-hand side. And on the left-hand side, there is a new tab being added. So now you can see this speaker status has been granted. You can also see it here on the overview of all the pro attendees. And you see that this little icon, the backstage was just added. So as soon as you, or once you have been made a speaker and it's your turn to be presenting on the main stage, all the things you do is simply click on the backstage and say, enter backstage. Also, if your hosts want to do that for you, they can move you into the back backstage so that you don't have to do anything. And that's the screen that you will have. So we have embedded here a third party service. That's why it asks you again for a name that should be displayed. So you can decide the name that people will see above from you. And you can also have here some settings. So you can see now it's the wrong camera selected. So I want to change the camera to, work, to select the, the correct one. So I click on cam mic. And then I have here the camera sections where I can select the different cameras that I have. And I'll use now the FaceTime and you can see it selects the right camera and you can also check the audio. But for me, that works fine. It selects my AirPods and you can see that there is some audio. You can also add some green screen um, if you want, like adding some uh, some backgrounds to you. But I think it really works well if you have a clear background screen, maybe green, blue. Um, yeah, and it takes some consumption of your CPU. So feel free to play around with it, but uh, you don't have to. So just make sure as soon as your camera is here selected, you can see that the mic is working on the right hand side. Simply add your name and say enter broadcast studio. And that's the view that you will have as uh, a speaker. Basically on the top is what is presented to the main stage at the moment. And then you see that you are currently backstage. And if the host now says, well, it's your turn. So they can then put you onto the main stage. So I'm now switching to the host view in the background and you can see now, yeah, they are putting you on the main stage. They can also change the view, how you will be presented. And so they can add, for example, some overlays, or also a little banner to say that's uh, here, Alex from uh, Berkeley. And if you want to share your presentation, then all you have to do is click this little share screen. And you have all the options that you're used to from other applications. So you can share the entire screen. You can also share just one application window or a specific Chrome tab. So on the application window, I've prepared a little pitch that I want to share. And now you can see that there's this uh, pitch. And also here in the bottom, there's a second window appearing. And the host will see this window and he can allow to add this one to the screen. I'm just doing this now. And then also have like different views of you and your presentation. So you can see this in this view now. On the left hand side, this will be still you. And on the right hand side, you can see the presentation that you're sharing and you have the control of the slides. So if you click further or move on on your slides, you will see that um, this will also change here on the slides in the background. As I said, you can also share your Chrome browser, your browser, any tab, uh, everything that you want to share with the audience.